The FBI has asked a court to order us to give them something that we don't have, to create an operating system that does not exist. The reason it doesn't exist is because it would be too dangerous. They are asking for a backdoor into the iPhone, specifically to build a software tool that can break the encryption system which protects personal information on every iPhone. As we have told them, and as we've told the American public, building that software tool would not affect just one iPhone. It would weaken the security for all of them. In fact, just last week, Director Comey agreed, and I think we heard the same here today, that the FBI would likely use this as precedent for other cases involving other phones. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman, and welcome to the witnesses. Uh, let me... The FBI is asking Apple to weaken the security of our products. Hackers and cyber criminals could use this to wreak havoc on our privacy and personal safety. It would set a dangerous precedent, precedent for government intrusion into the privacy and safety of its citizens. Hundreds of millions of law-abiding citizens trust Apple's products with the most intimate details of their daily lives. Photos, private conversations, health data, financial accounts, and information about a user's location and the location of that user's family and friends. In six months, and where it'll be in two to five years. What we're gonna do is decrease our security. That's the security risk that's coming from, from the requests. Now I get that law enforcement wants data protection that allows them access under legal authorization. But an NSA colleague once remarked to me that while his agency had the right to break into certain systems, no one ever guaranteed that that right would be easy to do so. The problem is when you build a way in for someone who isn't the owner to get at the data, well you've built a way in for somebody else to get in as well. That law has, has said that large scale data breaches have nothing to do. Now the FBI already has some excellent people and expertise, but FBI in investment and capacity is not at the scale and level necessary. Rather than asking industry to weaken protections, law enforcement must instead develop the capability for conducting sophisticated investigations themselves. Process which there has been uh, 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 in this case. We believe this line being drawn between public safety and privacy is extremely important. It's affecting our lives, it's affecting our constituents' lives, and we believe that you should be drawing it. And we ask you to address this problem quickly. Is it possible to encrypt the data in iCloud? Yes, actually in the iOS 8 and 9 generation, we have encrypted the iCloud.